people damn i have not done an intro in like this in so long if you're an og subscriber you guys would know that we used to do this fridge intro talking to the fridge every single day but welcome back to another vlog so today the day after the pop-up shop i need to organize all the stock that we have for the upcoming drop online on thursday at 6 p.m so there's a lot of stocks to count i need to do all the sizes and everything have that written down so that you guys are able to purchase it and everything is done correctly and no one's missing out on whatnot and if i have time i also need to embroider a lot more dog hoodies because i'm getting a lot of orders yay which i'm so excited about so let's start the day Good um, afternoon, actually, afternoon. I am currently at KTN Motor Works with Vinny. Vinny's in the background drawing on my cams. I got my cams today straight from Japan, straight from Tomei Express. So shout out to guys from Otaku, Otaku, O-T-A-K-U Garage for hooking it up. I appreciate them guys because I really need it. That was pretty much the last piece of the puzzle, but there's still a whole bunch of little bits and pieces that I actually need to go get. I need to get fuel fear things, I need to get braided lines, braided hoses, and a whole bunch of other stuff. So I'll show you guys what I'm doing. Okay, so what Vinny's doing right now is drawing the fuel filter, uh, fuel lines and what fittings I actually need because we need to join this fuel pressure regulator into the car and we're trying to figure out what bends it needs. This is Vinny's artistic work. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly got his pen license way too early. I got my injector plugs, finally got the right one, so they need to adapt from my standard injector to my new aftermarket injectors here. And still don't have a motor in the car. And there's still two sitting there right there. Decided to work on the pet hoodies, so I've done one for a pet influencer. Her name is Bad Girl Peaches. She's really, really cute. I'm so in love with her. I did this for a customer, Frankie. It's the first orange one we've done, which is pretty nice. I really like this colorway. And another customer here called Charlie, which is the usual gray on pink. Everyone honestly has been loving this color lately. It's probably one of the top color coordinates that everyone gets, or the gray on white or the black on white. But now I'm going to leave the house, I'm going to go Ada's Colour, I'm going to go to the post office, go to the shops and everything, buy groceries, buy a new mop because I need to buy a new mop as our current one. It plugs into the wall and it just gets a little bit annoying going in and out and stuff. So I'm just going to get one so I can quickly do as much of it as I can. So let's head there now. I just quickly got changed and I wanted to show you guys the tech hoodie. A lot of people are asking about the sizing. This sizing right here is different to the Blossom ones. So I was the one that created this. And the reason why I created this was because I wanted to create the oversized boyfriend jumper. As you guys can see, it's really wide on me. This is a size extra small. Biggie, you're really annoying right now. This is a size extra small. And the arms, however, are pretty good fitting on me. So anybody, if you have longer arms, I would honestly probably recommend going up one size. However, if you're pretty like normal length arms and you're pretty short, I would definitely stay true to size. No matter what, it's still gonna be like really baggy and oversized, but this is just the look that I designed. And I think it goes well with the tech because it's like dangling at the back and all that stuff. So yeah, I hope this helps you guys because we've had a lot of questions about it. Let's go to AS Color. Um, I'm at the car wash, not the car wash, sorry. I'm at the petrol station, just left independent car parts right here, if you guys can see. Yes, it's in Ravenhall, it's a bit of a hike, but I had to order everything specially because they didn't have what I needed. I wanted a whole bunch of fittings like this to get braided hose lines. Because running E85, I'm gonna stop trying to run as much rubber hoses and I needed fittings to fit into this. So these, see these little holes right here, on, there's one on both sides. I need a piece like this that screws into here so it works. This obviously doesn't work. And then on top of that, I had to get new hoses for the water. Top of that, didn't follow anything on Vinny's diagram because they didn't have anything in stock. Um, Philly's gotta go pick it up tomorrow, but you guys, oh, you guys actually don't know because we took a day off from vlogging. I'm going to Sydney tomorrow, correct. So I'm going to Sydney tomorrow to check out the new sneaker a laundry in Sydney, which is insane. Anyway guys, let's go back to what Philly's doing. I gotta quickly go to Saint side, I gotta return the bike that you guys saw at the pop-up and also one bear brick. And actually I sold a bear brick for him as well, which was beautiful.
Which way is my steering wheel? Oh, okay, cool. Okay, I can leave now. Here at AS Color, let's head inside. Package all done and ready. Now we can head back before the traffic starts. I washed my hair yesterday as well, guys, and I kind of like the way it's faded. It's still a little bit splotchy, but this week, I think I'm definitely gonna go brown forever, or maybe like a dark blonde. I'm kind of getting sick of my hair having all random colors and stuff, so I'm just gonna go one of those. I'm not sure I'm gonna have a think about it and not do a crazy impulse buy like this right here, but it's not bad, it's not bad. <laughs> All right, guys, so I'm back home right now in the garage. I have a whole heap of boxes I need to start counting. You can see behind me, there's a heap. I'm going to show you guys the left side. There's all these boxes over here. We need to count every single one of them in every single style, every single size and everything so that it's ready for the pop-up. It's going to be a really, really lengthy process. I need to get some pen and paper and just start jotting everything down. Hopefully, Hal will be home soon so he can help me. Otherwise, if not, my cousin can help me tomorrow and we can do it together. But it's got to be done, babe. But it's got to be done ASAP. Luckily, some of the boxes are labeled. So like accessories, this can just straight up go in the house. This is air fresheners and stickers, so that can go in the house. But then a lot of them, I have no idea what they are. So I'm going to have to start opening each and every one up. Gonna tackle this box first, which seems easily enough. These are just all the pants, but there's all different sizes in here. So this is going to be interesting. organizing all the stock counted all the blossoms right here we've got the white other blossoms all here we've got the borg jackets over here there's the, all the denim ones so it goes in like an l shape we've got some pants and then the tech plane jumpers which i need to sew i still haven't counted the stock for the denim jackets and the pants However, I'm absolutely freezing in this garage, so I'm going to go inside, start counting the lanyards and all of that stuff. And I think I'm going to make some dinner because I really want to have home-cooked food tonight because I've been eating a lot of takeaway lately and my body just is feeling very ugh and just like I need some good Asian food in my body. So let's go inside because way, way, way too cold out here. Come on, Biggie. Let's go inside. It's too cold. Oh, it's even honey. Not even Biggie. Sorry, honey. All right, anyway guys, I'm leaving Sensat right now, but let me quickly talk to you in the car, hold up. What you guys don't understand is like, okay, I, I, I go to Sensat and I want to tell you guys that if it wasn't for Mark and Nat, a lot of the things that I learned about my own business and it, like what you guys don't know, before I even opened Cocaine, before I even started dating Philly, I went to Sensat every single day that I possibly could and just pick their brains. And I literally, and they're more than happy to help me. So anytime that I can possibly help them now, I'm more than happy to help Sandside. Like you guys don't understand, they, they give up their time for me. I'm more than happy to come in, speak to them, talk to them, pick their brains. They can pick my brains, I give them whatever information they need. They can give me what information they want. And it's great. It, it's just, it that's how it works. That's how a community and, and everything should work because we feel like we are the brands that should be helping each other rather than trying to be a business that's trying to chop another business's head off. Like technically, yeah, they are my competitors. Yeah, because they're another street label, streetwear label that people are purchasing and they've got a great marketing. But for me, it's like, we need to team up and we, we need to build a community together because in Australia right now, that's not what we have and that's what we need here. Anyway guys, let's go back home. Um, I've had a really long day already and I, I'm actually really happy with the meeting that I just had with Mark and Nat. We might have something to be cooking with the same type of people real soon, so. Hey, oh, honey just freaked out. Hi, princess. How's your day today? Hey, I told you. She doesn't care. Anyway, Philly made uh, dinner. What'd you make for dinner, babe? I made tikka, which is caramelized pork belly. I think I did a pretty good job because I spent like an hour braising it and everything. We have just like a plain soup and cucumbers and rice. Cucumbers are my favorite. I swear, love them. 
I just gotta quickly show you guys this crazy pickup that happened on Saturday night after the pop-up shop. We all headed to the sneaker laundry to chuck away all the cardboard boxes and rubbishes in their bin there because they have like this huge tip and everything. Chase was chucking it away and he comes back with a pair of these. These are the Acne Studio sneakers and they were straight up brand new. Someone from the apartments threw them in the bin. Like what the heck? It honestly had the paper still around here, like the clear plastic sticky bit. I took it off because I ended up wearing it that night to go DJ and oh my God, these were my size. He was kind enough, he gave them to me. And now I have a brand new pair of Acne Studio shoes. Like how crazy and how lucky is that? Like you can even tell that they're brand new because it's not even creased on the side or anything. It's so insane. So thank you, Chase. You're probably watching it. I really, really appreciate this. And uh, yeah, I got a brand new pair of shoes. So crazy. Thank you for watching that video guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's something really weird. I'm wearing a singlet and it's winter time in Melbourne, but in our house it's always 30 degrees and it's always warm. Anyway guys, hope you guys appreciate it. Hit that thumbs up button, hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed. And if you are subscribed guys, I know YouTube is having this really bad issue about the notification button. I think you click the notification button and then it gives you like options or whatnot and then you yeah, I don't know. I, I really don't know. But if you guys want to keep being notified, click that bell button. Work it out. I appreciate you guys. Thank you everyone who came down to the pop-up store. It was insane. I really appreciate it. It is currently 1 a.m. in the morning and my flight is at 6.35 a.m. So that means I need to get to the airport at 5.45 a.m. Which means I need to leave at 5 a.m. I haven't packed. And that's in four hours. Do you know this question that you guys always ask me, how do I do it with no sleep? Do you know what's, how do I do it? Honestly, I love caffeine. Caffeine is my thing. Coffee, V's, that's what I run on. I cannot eat for the whole day and just drink a lot of coffee and I'll be fine with that. That's a horrible thing to say, but I'll speak to you guys on tomorrow's video when I'm in Sydney. I'm there for two days, not really two days. I'm literally there to choose the Tuesday the whole day. We stay overnight and then we fly back Oh, let's really hope this store, we're going to see the store for the first time in Sydney. So I'll see you guys tomorrow and you guys can see the new store in Sydney. And don't forget guys, Thursday, this Thursday, so you guys will see this straight away. The Thursday, 6pm Australian Eastern Standard Time, so an hour after we usually drop our vlogs. The website for our merch will be available, so if you guys want to buy it, go nuts. If you guys just appreciate it, I appreciate you. I'm not trying to tell you guys to buy anything if you guys don't want to. It doesn't really bother me because I know you guys, you know, this, yeah, yeah, you get it. Peace.